Calling all winners, calling all losers. We've got a shakeup coming. Yes, hold the show. We've got oh, we've only got five turns left. Let's look at the standings. Wario is in first place. Daisy's in second place. Looper's in third place. Luigi has taken fourth place. Now we head into the final five, especially or anything could happen, especially since it's time for That's right, Chump Charity. Can losers become winners? Let's find out. Let's give our last place player just one piece of duo candy. Can you catch up now, Luigi? Wait a minute, Luigi's about to get the star. If Luigi got that star in the last turn, and I, I would have got the Chump Charity, because I would got zero stars, and this is kind of dumb, Ballyhoo. Okay, so every time we get the final uh, five turns, we get uh, coins on each spaces. Which, I don't really care about that, because... I got like over a hundred coins. Alright, so we're in the final five turns now. Which means this is the time for me to get... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, well... Uh, never mind, Luigi. I guess you can have the Chump Charity now, because... You just let Wario took your star. And Wario is now in first again. I need to buy a Dulo candy. Oh, basically, a Dulo candy uh, lets you, uh, whoever's in front of you, you'll do it, you'll, you will duel with somebody for, uh, coins or a star. And Wario's right there! I didn't even notice that the star's right next to him. Oh, wait, Daisy could probably spring to Wario. I kind of hope she does. Actually, wait. If she doesn't, they'll be, like, tied for first. Oh, she just missed them by a little bit. And she got Luigi. Now I forgot what I was just saying. Oh, yeah. Duel Candy lets you duel whoever's in front of you or whoever's near you. Oh, you basically roll two dice blocks. And if you win the minigame, and if your opponent has a star, then they can actually take that star. If not, you can just take coins. So it's like the Star Battle Arena. Like y'all do a duel game, uh, a, a duel mini game, and whoever wins takes points from the opponent. But in Party Ten, you can actually take a uh, star. And Luigi got the star. Or at least Wario didn't get it. And now I'm the only one who doesn't have a star. I don't even know how how in the hell did I not even have a star yet. The star better be close to me. It better be. Am I down there? I hope I'm. I hope I did not pass that. If I did, that would be a that would be terrible. I hope I'm behind the star. Yes. Okay, I am. Okay, this is my time. This is my time to shine. Okay, I think that's enough. No, I don't want to go in there. I don't want to go in there. No. All right, that's enough. Okay, good. It's about time to get a star. <laughs> yes, I still have a, a lot of money. Okay, I'm gonna be in second now. Okay, good. Now, if I can just buy a uh, duo candy, I can probably do Wario if he's in front of me. Okay, the star's probably gonna be far away. Oh yeah, a little bit. Hopefully, I'll land all the DK space next turn, because that'll be a miracle. Okay, another 1v3. It's like, at least like one or two players land on a red space every turn. Okay, a new minigame again. I can tell if there's a minigame that we have not played yet, because it has all those question marks, and it's not lit up. But if they are lit up, that means that we already saw it. <clears throat> Alright, so here we go. Pre picture perfect. 
Stop the turning panels to match the target image. You'll have 20 seconds for each round. Working solo, select one panel at a time. Working as a team, stick with the separate panels. And you basically, the one player and the three player, press A or B to turn the, plant, the panel rotation on or off. It's basically like a puzzle minigame. You just gotta match the, uh, the picture that's gonna be shown. I think I like this as the one player better, because sometimes the team of three, like, messes it up. So, we'll have to see. So the first one's a cloud. We gotta just pick all the, the cloud pieces. Here's like a puzzle here. Nope. Oh, what? See, we're too slow on that one. Next is mushroom. Nope. Alright, we got that one. Alright. We, we, we did that one pretty fast. An egg. Oh, it's not that one. There we go. Alright. We need one more to win this. Mushroom again. Oh, not one. Uh, wait, that's not the one. There we go, we won. Oh, well, Luigi almost got that one. I think he almost clicked on the, the panel, but he just missed. Alright, we won that one. Okay, I should probably talk about the uh, the bonus stars now. Uh, yeah, I got a, I still got like a lot of coins. So we're almost done, we have four turns left. Here are the bonus stars. So you get like, whenever the game ends, uh, the, the host just picks three random bonus stars. You don't know what they are until they show it. Um, there's one with the minigame star, like whoever wins the most coins in minigames, which I pretty I think I have that, because I have like 120 coins. Oh dang it! Shit. I knew Ori was trying to get that. Man, damn it. Oh, jeez. Wow, DK is really strong. Like, he just threw, like, a... Like, 50 feet. Jeez. I didn't even know he had a slow can. I di and I didn't even know he was... I didn't even know that he was close to the, uh... The DK space. Okay, please be close to me, at least. Okay, uh, I can live with that. He's, he's, he's gonna pass it, so that's good. Man, Wario, he's just having a good day. Oh no, don't, please don't use it on me, Daisy. Yeah, the minigame star is like whoever wins the most coins in minigames. Which they mostly, uh, show that out of all the three. And, um, there's another one with a, the running star. Uh, whoever travels the farthest, which I think Wario is the one with the running star. I think I have the minigame star. There's one called the candy star. Whoever uses the most candy, which that's not me. I think, uh, I think Luigi, yeah, he's the candy star. And Luigi's about to do, uh, Daisy. So we're, we're back in Star Battle Arena, kind of. Let's see if they get a minigame that we haven't played, which they most likely will, because we didn't really play much of dual minigames anyway, so... Anyway, there's one with a shopping star. Whoever spends the most coins in shops, which I did not... I did not get that... I'm not gonna get that star anyway, because I did not... I didn't pay anything in a shop, because... Only if they have a thrice candy. Okay, we actually did like a lot of these dual minigames. Um, I think there's another one with a red star. Yeah, red star. Um, whoever lands on the most red spaces. I think Wario has that. But I think Wario might be the winner of this first board, guys. I hope I get the minigame star. There's also one with the green star. Whoever lands on the most uh, green spaces. I, I'm not sure who has that. Hopefully, I might be Daisy who has that one. Oh, that was kind of quick. Okay, so this is called, uh... Lava... Lobbers, I think? Or Lobber... Lava? No, it's Lava... 
It's lava lavas. You just gotta uh, shoot at each other until whoever dies. So since Luigi won that, he can actually steal a star from Daisy. Which he pretty much missed, and he got 10 coins instead of 20. If I was doing someone, and if I had, if I had like an opportunity to get the star, I would probably get the star because I think, I think I know how to control the uh, the dice, the dart wheel. Okay, I think I get a, I gotta go left, right? I wish I had a high number. Oh wait, there's a shop. Okay, good. There's a shop there. And I think that's all the uh, the bonus stars. So there's like. Minigame star, running star, candy star, shopping star, red star, and green star. Let me know if there's one that I'm missing, but I think that's all of them. Oh, I actually like this game. Punch a bunch. Alright, here we go. Four player. I'm, man, what's all with these 2v2 and 1v3? We're back. Four player. Punch the statue to pieces. Throw a punch when the glove swells up to... Up to do the most damage. Don't just punch a lot, it's better to punch only when the glove is the largest. And just punch it. Uh, you wanna only punch when the glove is the, the largest, cause it'll do the most damage. Like this. Just wait like a second and then do it. The computer players can be pretty good at this if it's on hard or very hard difficulty. I think I won this one, hopefully. Yeah, there we go, I won. Oh, I, I kind of like that one. And that's kind of a fun minigame, because they were punching at Bowser's statue, and everyone doesn't like Bowser. That's what you get, Bowser. I think we're on the last three turns, or two. Hopefully it's a third turn. Last three turns, okay. And Wario, the good thing about him, he's going to miss the star. So that's good. But he has three stars. So uh, after the end of the game, if they show like the running or red star, then Wario just pretty much won the game. If they show something else like the minigame, green or candy or shopping, I'll probably get one of those two, maybe. So there's a chance. Anything could happen, pretty much. Okay, I'm like the closest one to the star, so hopefully I get that one. Oh, no. Oh, wait, no. That can's gonna go to the other side, so... Yeah, so... Yeah, it's gonna go to the other side. He's gonna miss the star, so... He's got, he has to go to the other one. Oh, what the fuck? Wait a minute. I use that cannon. Okay, so is this game trying to... ruin me or something? Does it change, like, every time? Hold on. Hold on a second. Like, what in the hell just happened? I used this cannon right here. And it went from there to here. And a couple of turns ago, Luigi used this cannon and it went to here. But somehow... Luigi decides to use this cannon, and then it went to the the other the other way. So does it like change every time? Are you kidding me? Now Luigi's gonna get the star. No, no one's in front. I need to get a I need to get a thrice cannon. Don't you get a? Okay, good. Don't get a one. Ah, uh, never mind. Okay. Please have a thrice candy. I need that. Or actually, either that or a duo. Okay. Okay. I need this. The other candies are good, but this is really the most important, especially if you're losing. Alright, another four players. So that's good. See, look, the, the wheel changes, like, every time, so... I guess it's because I can't fit every minigame on the wheel. I guess that's understandable. Okay, in the nick of time. Turn the clock's hands to match the image. Whoever gets three matches first wins. 
Slow down your rotation when you get close to the correct time so you don't pass it up. And you just turn the clock with your remote left to right. I actually like this mini game. It's kind of fun. And it's really not that hard either for me. I could lose this one because the computer player is on hard mode. What? I think I can still win this one. Uh, okay. So, like, go fast and then once you get newer, just slow down a little bit. Like that. And it's really not that hard for me. Oh wow, look how close this one. I'm gonna get this one. Wow, I'm already at two. One more. Oh, looks like Warrior can get this one here. Yep, he got that one. That's okay, I'm still at two. Somebody can get this one too. Louise or Daisy. Oh, see, I did not slow down. Oh, other way. Oh, dang it, Warrior's gonna get that one. He got that one. Oh no, don't let Warrior win this. Okay. Okay. Oh wait, Luigi could get this one. Nope, I'm gonna get it. Oh wait, no. Keep going. Ah, oh, man. I did not pay attention. Wait. Oh, what? I was turning, but it didn't work. Wow, we just did like a huge comeback. I think I still got the minigame star because I have 129 coins, so that's a lot. Alright, here we go. Last two turns. Which I am going to use my thrice candy. Actually, uh, Luigi can actually get that star because he's like two spaces. Hopefully, he gets a one, which shall be amazing for him. Okay, I don't know why he... Uh, there's really nothing up there, so I don't know why he used that. I think I know why he used that, because for the candy star. And plus, there's only three turns left, so... Oh, wait, I got a candy? I got a... Uh, oh, yeah. A Wiggly and a Thrice candy. But... Luis doesn't have any candy. Okay, please get a one, please get a one, please get a one, please get a one! Ugh, no. Well, the star's probably gonna go all the way down. Okay, I'm in third. I'm, I'm gonna try and get a saw before the game ends. And it's all the way there. Oh, it's back there again. It's back there. Okay, everyone is far away from that. So I'm definitely gonna use my thrice candy. I don't wanna use the blow away because I might be too far. We need to get a high number this time. And hopefully I can get to the other shop. I got a high enough number here. There we go. Alright. Okay, good. That's a high number. I did say in the Star Brown Ring, if you flick your Remo fast, you get a high number, which sometimes I did that, but I guess I didn't do it fast enough. Probably because it. Probably because I got a lot of low numbers, but for Thrice Candy, I, I... Okay, maybe I can get a higher number if I flick it faster than I did. Okay, this is the sale. Okay, this is a hard decision. Actually, I'm gonna get this, because if I get this, then everyone is, uh, everyone is behind me, so... I'm gonna be smart and get this, and I can probably get the star next turn again. How many faces do I have left? I have seven. Oh, I land on a red space. I want to do four-player game. Oh wait, I'm the one player, so I can probably win this one. Wait, what? Oh, battle mini game. Okay, so we get like two battle games uh, every board. 
All right, so it might be 15 or 20 this time. Oh, it's still 10, okay. It's gonna be 40, let's see if I can win this one. Even if I don't win, it's not gonna matter because I still have like 100 coins. All right, so we've done two battle games. Oh, well, we already saw this one. 